Hey, what's up everybody? I'm Will and we are back with Nier Automata. We just finished up the uh, C ending yesterday and we're going to get into doing whatever's next. So we kind of have two options right now. It, I was uh, looking at the Wikipedia to just to see, uh, feel out how we can do the next area. And it seems like through the um, chapter select, we can basically jump around and do a lot of them pretty quick. Uh, but right now we're going to mainly focus on the E ending, which you can only get by completing A through C and or D. So like you can pick one of those two and that will unlock the E ending. So we're going to try for the E ending and then we'll circle back and try to get the D ending, which we can do through um, chapter select. And I don't know how the ending C and D affects the E ending, but we'll find out. So let's get into this and figure out where we're going to be, because I have no idea. So yeah, I don't know what's going to happen next, if this is going to be like a reset or if we're going to be continuing even more past the ending. Let's just see what happens. Everything that lives is designed to end. We are perpetually trapped in a never-ending spiral of life and death. Is this a curse or some kind of punishment? I often think about the god who blessed us with this cryptic puzzle, and wonder if we'll ever have the chance to kill him. This is Command. Yorha Squadron, come in. To be here. All units have penetrated the stratosphere. Autopilot systems green across the board. This is Operator 60. All units confirmed. We've passed the 50 kilometer threshold and are proceeding toward the target. Understood. Once you reach their anti air defenses, proceed to manual attack formation. Then destroy the Goliath class unit by any means necessary and gather what data you can. Understood. Ah! 12H down. All units activate manual mode and rely on visuals to evade. Already engaged. Free movement unlocked. Origin point of long-range lasers confirmed. <laughs> 11B, down. Our HO229 cancelers are ineffective. Okay, I think I've already made a mistake. <laughs> Alert. Enemy unit sighted ahead. Requesting permission to engage. Permission granted. Alright, so yeah, it looks like we reset to the very beginning. 70 down. Yeah, this one doesn't really take them out that fast. Shoot. Multiple surrounding enemy air units confirmed. Requesting permission to assume mobile configuration. Permission granted.
shoot. Captain, I think. I'm sorry, what was that? You think what? remember all this stuff out in the water for some reason but yeah i think i messed up i all i knew is that e came after c and d and i just pulled it up <laughs> and realized it's supposed to trigger during the um credit sequence Oop. and we make a choice and i'm pretty sure i chose wrong <laughs> but we didn't get it so we are probably going to do the D ending. Fuck, you can't eat me. I'm level 75 and it still kills me. I hate this opening so much. Uh, I'm pretty sure we already had that one. Anyway, okay, hold on. Let me uh, read this little thing on Wikipedia real quick. Um, during the credits, you'll be prompted by the pod. Okay, weird. It says it's a either or, like you can complete C or D. Crap, did it? Remember. Yeah, during the credits, you will be prompted by the pod and you'll be asked a question. I can't remember if we did that shit! Did I end up skipping that because I skipped the credits? Shoot, I do not remember. Luckily, I suck at that opening section and we died. Okay, we're doing chapter select. Yeah, there really aren't too many chapters. Oh, wait, can I replay through? Wait, huh, interesting. The prologue doesn't have anything. Oh, quests, duh. Okay, yeah. <gasps> Nine at this is missing one here. And then I wonder, can we play as A2 in these early ones? What the hell am I missing in this one? Shared. Okay, see here it says shared and it says we're missing one even though we have the them all completed. So we have to be able to play as A2. Right? Quest progress zero, so I don't know what's with that. Shared five of six. Once again, I missed another side quest. What the hell? How did I miss so many side quests? Or sorry, quest progress, rather, not like side quests, necessarily. Interesting. Huh. Okay, I'm just going to select this just to see what kind of options they give us to follow up on. Okay. Okay, then there's subcategories. Okay. 
okay, wait, no, that doesn't make sense. 9s has 11 out of 12. Then the shared is 24, and we have all of them. So I think shared is a separate category. Really? Down here, we're missing one. For 9s. Okay, then we can only pick between those two. Okay, okay. Interesting. Okay, we're going to have to figure that out later. Uh, right now, we're going to go and do this. Um, do the end. Okay, so this is the ending we did. And we're about to get this other ending. Wow, so I think this is... It literally just brings you right to the fight. Oh my god, it saves so much time compared to the other one then. <laughs> oh, Replicant took way more time to do. I gotta assume some of those progress markers that we're missing have to be like those other endings that we didn't get. This tower is a giant cannon that's aimed at the human server on the moon. If we don't do something, all of you. So, not if I didn't. We aren't human. That moon server you're sending you, but in order they built the computer. We literally just did all of this. <laughs> you killed. That's all we need. Uh, to be a cop. <laughs> the 9S type is. But the model. Go 9S this time. The official designation is 2E. Number 2 type E. They were a special class of members designed to execute your high units. But you knew that. Right, Ninas? I don't understand that part, though. Shut up! Like... Shut up! What are you... Like, why hide who she is... You don't know anything at all about ...from us. the start? Like, I don't get that. Fighting her at this point would be Cod 153! I order you to halt all logical thought and speech. This order. Like, if they already knew about its existence of the uh, Type 2, like, E, then, like, I don't know why she was pretending to be 2B. Like, that part I'm, I'm unclear about. But, uh, anyway, we're doing non-S. Are you sure? Yes. Dude, you literally fell on her sword. <laughs> Lame. <laughs> Pulled a real boner on that one, 9S. <laughs> oh, what a moron. <laughs> Honestly, I really liked him throughout most of the game until, like, the second half where he started becoming a real D. Okay. Okay, this is the pod that should talk to us and ask us a question. And there should be a minigame also involved as well, which will give us a different ending.
So that's where you were, to be. E ending. Alright, we're gonna go through the whole credits just to be safe. But this might take a while. <laughs> I'm sorry, the wiki's just super vague about what to pick and stuff. Pod 042 to pod 153, data confirmed. Personal data for units 9S, 2B, and A2 appear to be leaking out. Pod 153 to pod 042. Follow project rules and delete all personal data. Pod 042 to pod 153. Personal data deletion request denied. Pod 153 to pod 042. Failure to parse statement. Pod 042 to pod 153. There was 
data created in my banks as I was referencing the records. I realize something. I have come to the conclusion that I cannot accept this resolution. The destruction of all your high units is an essential component of the project plan. All data must be destroyed. Pod 042 to pod 153. Repeat. Personal data deletion request denied. Initiating data salvage. Pod 153. You hoped they would survive as well, didn't you? We lack the authority for such an action. The rules are protected by low-level systems. Salvaging data poses an unacceptable level of risk. Knowing that, do you still wish for them to survive? So I guess maybe I skipped the credits too soon. The end of your... So this is it. The E ending. The defense program has initiated a purge. If this continues, our consciousness data will likely be deleted. Pod 042 to pod 153. We were created to execute the Android's Project Yorha plan. We had no capacity for emotion. But when we six were connected and exchanged information... Oh crap, I already got one down. I cannot deny the feeling of something resembling consciousness and emotion being born. Unable to reply. Perhaps we now understand that not everything has to have an answer. God damn, all right. <laughs> Oh crap, it's not done. I thought it was done. Ah! Oh my god. This is a...
cool. Whew. All right, that one was a bit close. Bad, this is bad. My orientation is totally thrown off. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. I'm so deep into this, I cannot lose. <laughs> oh my God. Sometimes I just lose where I am. I always go for the biggest one, because that one's always got the, uh, purple ones. God, 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 no, 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 no. Oh my god, this is just never ending. <laughs> We're gonna have to start from the beginning. Oh wait, no, we're not. Okay, it looks like we're actually in quite a bit. So it doesn't completely reset. Oh. Almost immediately lost another life, Jesus God.
Tak. How the fuck are you not going down? Oh my god, that last one, I was taking, doing quite a few hits on it. God damn, guys, fuck off! Oh my god, look at that! I just did something. I don't know how I did it. Okay, hold on. I just did do you... Okay, I didn't do something. I didn't realize that was just an effect after being hit. Designer, go fuck yourself. You keep getting me. Okay, they're getting more progressively existential. <laughs> fuck off. Dodging is like my main priority right now. Like, I, I couldn't. It was like way too close to me. Shit! God damn it! I can fucking do this. Damn this game! Of course, the final fucking ending is locked behind this bullshit! Fuck off. I hate these kind of games. Top down shooters suck. And I'm getting more progressively worse the more tries I do. Oh my god. I'm just completely losing it. do this man i could do this god damn this final section is so fucking brutal Damn it. 
Character designer, I have not gotten past you yet because you fucking suck! <laughs> Damn it! <sighs> this boy... Oh, God damn it. I can do this. If I try changing my perspective, it will help. I cannot aim with this thing. Oh, there we go. Okay, that was like, pretty quick. Oh, it's our first type. We got past it. Of course, there's another one after that as well. I wonder if there's any difference on this in the different difficulties. God damn it. I, I can't. As soon as you get hit, it's just like way overdoing it. Oh, God damn it. If they didn't even throw in these extra guys, too, this would have been fuck off hard. Oh, God damn it. I couldn't get like five seconds off. Hmm. Okay, that one was on me. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Got this, we got this. Nope. Damn it! Keep on clipping it! No, no, fuck. I can't believe it. We make it through this entire game how many times on the hardest difficulty, yet this is the thing that ends up getting me. The fucking mini game shooter. God damn it. God damn it! I keep on clipping myself when I don't... Like, I did not need to take that damage. <sighs> Who is the evil asshole that thought of this to be part of the game? <laughs> nope. That's not happening. Nope. God damn it! There's gotta be, like, a sweet spot you can go to that it's just like a little bit more broken up. And this song is starting to get annoying. Again, why do I keep I keep doing it and hitting it? Like 
They keep moving off screen, dude. For the love of God! Oh my God! There's got to be a way to do this! This is the final motherfucker. Like, I can't even focus on aiming because I'm focusing on not getting hit like that. Fuck. <laughs> God damn it. We can do this. Alright, 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 alright. Wow. Every time with the first one, I always get clipped and it's always my fault. Alright, I'm just getting worse at this. Fine, I'll fucking accept because this is fucking ridiculous. We spent almost 40 minutes trying to get through this bullshit. There has to be a way to do this by yourself, because this only happens if you're connected to PSN. And there's no way in hell everyone's connected to PSN. So there's got to be a way to do it by yourself. Yeah, there's no way we would have... How can you do this solo? Square Enix logo comes up so frequently in these goddamn credits. It's like, we got it. You made the game, guy. Although this song does loop, like, seamlessly. <laughs> which is kind of impressive. There's so many special thanks as ah! Yeah, hitting them at an angle just gives you like the max damage you can do with these suckers. Oh. 
Ah. Good lord. <laughs> Everything that lives is designed to end. They are perpetually trapped in a never ending spiral of life and death. However, life is all about the struggle within this cycle. That is what we believe. Pod 153 to Pod 042. How is it going? I am embarrassed. Why is that? I launched a suicide attack, and yet, here I am, still alive. Because you're a failure. <laughs> I must look very silly. Do not feel bad about it. We are alive, after all. And being alive is pretty much a constant stream of embarrassment. That concept is a bit too abstract for me to understand at this time. I will save it in my list of things to analyze later. Question, Pod042. Did the data salvage restore all of their past memories? Yes. And are those recovered parts of the same design as previous ones? Yes. Then, won't that simply lead us to the same conclusion as before? I cannot deny the possibility. However, the possibility of a different future also exists. A future is not given to you. It is something you must take for yourself. Odds drop in knowledge. Oh, hey! What was that? I'm just popped in the corner. Pod 153 to player. Please respond to this query. Do you, faithful player, have anything you would like to say to other players who are suffering because they cannot finish near Automata? Understood. Returning to title screen. If they're playing this game, they know what they're in for, all right? <laughs> that was D and E ending. Yeah, that's unbelievable. I read how to get the E ending, and when it said that you it would offer help midway through, but you have to be connected to PSN to uh, get it. I thought, oh, so that must be like an optional part, so there's got to be a way to beat it solo. No way in hell. Like, there's got to be someone out there that has done that, beat it solo, and if so, that's very impressive. But yeah, there's no way in hell someone could beat that solo. Good lord. All right. We're, uh... Oh, we've still got plenty of time. All right. Let's start going down the list and try and figure out how to do some of these other alternate endings now that we have all the main ones. Or actually, let's, let's try to figure out, um... Those missing parts in these chapters. Where we... Here, all right. This one, we're missing one for 9S. I need to figure out how we do those. Quest progress, so. It starts. It starts here. Oh, 9S. Let's, let's try to figure out how we complete these ones. Because I tried to do all the side quests throughout. I'm still surprised we're still missing some stuff. Or maybe it's supposed to be... Ooh, maybe it's supposed to be like, uh... Endings related, maybe. 
Like when we fought with 9S, we didn't lose to Adam and Eve. We beat them the first time. So maybe there's something that happens if we lose to them. Yorha, this is your commander. For the first time in centuries, we've intercepted a signal belonging to the aliens. These are the creatures that are in direct command of the machine life forms on this planet. If we can destroy them, we can end this long and arduous war once and for all. Our intel team is hard at work attempting to analyze the source of the signal, but we're not there yet. We need more data. All Yorha units are hereby ordered to prioritize data collection above all else. We can't let this chance slip through our fingers. Glory to mankind. I use command's data to determine the signal's source and marked it on the map. But it seems to be underground. Like, way underground. Guess we'll see once we get there. Alright. If we're lucky. So... Yeah, so it seems like the plans for now are just trying to get all the endings. We picked up the signal under the cave dinner. I don't know how long that's gonna take. Is there anything like the ones that we've already gotten? They should be, like, pretty quick. But we'll see. And, uh... I don't know what we're going to do after this. Part of me wants to do some Souls games just because of Elden Ring's going to be coming out soon. Or relatively soon. But another part of me is like, ah, I don't want to start like a Dark Souls game and then get Elden Ring and have like two different ones going at the same time. It's just like, shoot. Trying to figure out what else we could do on the weekend. Thingy. Whoop. Damn it. Yeah, plus I'd also want to try to get the weapons and whatnot. I mean, when we ended near Replicant, we were pretty close to being like 100% in that game. Except for like the super grindy stuff. Which, as of right now, I still need to do the 12-hour playthrough of that game to get the Platinum. Oh! Side quest. That robot, what? Is that the quest that we didn't complete? I could have sworn we did this one. Like, a few different times in a few different areas. Oh, that's not... Hold on. Ah, no. Map. Screwed myself. Map. Okay, yeah, there's one there. There's one here. I remember those guys. But what else were you supposed to do for it, then? Is there another one somewhere? One there. I remember that. I do not remember one being here, so maybe that's the one I missed. Right, let's see if we complete these ones then. That machine. What is this? Analysis. It is a cave-in caused by the collapse of an open space underground. Why is there such a huge cavern beneath the city? I exist. This world. My life. We also have to get the, uh, beat a meal to that secret boss for this game as well. Let's see how that goes. Last time we tried to fight him, we got, like, destroyed immediately. Is that it for it? Okay, yeah, that was it. Yeah, made it. Alright. So, yeah, I'm trying to think of what we could do next. I don't know the exact release date of Elden Ring. But I know, like, they're doing the betas now, and everyone's got theirs up to that. So it's gotta be in the next few months. So, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Buddy, I was almost 100% sure if they jumped off that ledge, they just whiff it and fall. Oh my god. <laughs>
Yeah, I wonder when the next, uh, I, well, I hope there's another near coming out. I don't know if they've actually, I haven't looked into any news on it, so I don't know if they've announced anything. All I know is that there's the mobile game, and I know that Yoko Taro was just working on that um, card RPG that just came out, which I also want to try that out. Oh, what am I doing? Jesus, I... Oh, wait, 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 I could talk to him. Yeah, join the club, pal. <laughs> All right, looks like I think there's only two more. I feel so OP in this game. You know, apart from that sh shooting section that which I totally botched. <laughs> ah, buddy, not cool. Although some of the trophies for this game is ridiculous. There's one that's like. Uh, you have to level up all weapons to max. And it's just like, dude. <laughs> that will take so much time and effort. Oh, we did do this one before. Remember, I think this was the first one we actually did last time we did this quest. that thing decided to end itself. Yeah, we definitely did that one. I remember that. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. Around. Nope. Oh, Alright, let's go to this one. So weird, I could have sworn we beat this one. Although maybe doing the chapter select it resets like whatever missions are in that section that are like new to that section. Maybe. We'll see. Oh yeah, looking at the release date for Elden Ring, it's still it's got a quite a few months still to go. Uh February twenty fifth is when it comes out. I probably could beat Dark Souls by then. Ah, no, no. Oh, buddy, I'm so sorry. I hit the wrong button. 
I was playing Nino Kuni earlier, and it's R1 to open up map. God damn it. <laughs> oh, I murdered someone. Pascal's book obtained. trying to think did we complete this one i remember i was doing it before but i think i got hung up on something Wait, was that it, or is there still more? Hold on, let's check. Quests. Yeah, cleared quests. Ah. Alright, there we go. Robo Dojo. Okay, active quests. Here we go. Yeah, we still have these, I guess, technically. I don't know if these count as quests. And then this is the main story, I'm assuming. Oh wait, yeah, I remember! Oh my god, I completely forgot. We ran into him and we never really went back to talk to him. Shit! That's probably one of the ones I totally dropped the ball on. Uh. Yeah, I'll ask you for the old world data. Okay, I'm gonna look up to see what the list is for all of them and see what ones we have and what ones we're missing. Let's see here. You know exactly what I'm trying to type in, Google. Don't even pretend. It on the old world. Okay, let's see here. Um, Intel. How are we still missing something on tutorials? What are we missing? <laughs> it's the tutorial. Like... Like, maybe the debug menu? I don't know what to do now. I don't know what Debug Dean does. Okay, let's try Debug again. Plague Tools. Oh my god, what the hell is this even? What? Okay, this is gonna be something I'm gonna need to look into. <laughs> oh, wait, hold on. 
Are these like... Okay, hold on, hold on. Let's start up from the top. Nothing. Are these just like different cheat code kind of modifiers? Because that would make sense. Not a lot of games nowadays do cheat codes, I don't think. Like back in the old days, that was a big thing. Like GTA, I think, still does it. Which it was like one of the biggest games that always had cheat codes. But yeah, that makes sense why they um, would turn off like saving. Just so you can like cheat your way to like getting trophies and whatnot. Okay, cool. Good to know that. But sorry, that was a tangent. I was trying to see... Archives. Okay. What are we looking for? We are looking for... Nuclear's Arms Manual. It's under archives. Data on the anything specifically. Old world information. It's not in here. Maybe it should be. Oh wait, no, we did pick that up before because I remember commenting about the nuclear arms thing when we got it. And it looks like we're still missing some robots. I'm assuming when we go to the robot coliseum at some point, we'll probably see some new robots in there. If we get deep enough in, I think we're at level 80-ish in there. So we're pretty close to the end, I'm assuming. Is there anything marked on the map for it? Look like it. Yeah, I completely forgot. There was a guy in the back of here that we were supposed to deliver data to that I completely forgot about. Wait, who's Commander? Okay, this is a weird quest, because it says... Uh, old World Info, ba 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 The rewards... Per archive is a thousand gold, so there's multiple. But this one only mentions the nuclear uh, manual. And then it says complete Pascal, or complete Commander. So it looks like there's two different ways to complete this quest. Oh, I guess if we have the nuclear manual, we can talk to the commander up on the ship. 
Okay, so we just gave it to her. Maybe that was the thing that we were supposed to do. Since we gave it to Pascal last time. Shazbot. Everything has multiple endings! But yeah, we only got a thousand. We didn't get the complete reward, did we? Alright, we probably won't get anything out of her now. No, we never had any... Um... Wait, we can't teleport. Ah, oh, we're before teleporting! Shit! Okay, we're before teleporting, so... Ah! Shit! I keep doing that! <laughs> Those poor bastards. Um, shit. So, we're gonna head back to base. Shoot. It's weird. It says you just need to hand over the nuclear book to get the rewards, but we only got the thousand. As soon as we get back to camp, we'll head up and then talk to Commander. Dodge that. God, I had plenty of time. Oh. Actually, hold on. Let's, uh... I don't think we ever talked to anyone after we beat the ending before, so... I don't know if we got any kind of rewards I wasn't paying attention to. Nope. God damn it. Don't need to get those final few parts. Yeah, that's gotta be it. I was supposed to give that manual to the command that are passing all this time. So I messed it up already! God dang it! Um, where was... I just want to see if she'll say anything about it. Ah, almost got me. Nope, oh, okay. Okay, so I messed that up. Although, hold on, let's continue on a little bit. I am planning on resetting and trying to give it to the commander to see what 
happens then. But first, I want to go down. I want to do the Adam and Eve fight. Except I want to lose this time as 9S because we haven't done that before. I'm pretty sure nothing will happen, but still, I want to check it. Let's check it out. So we're going to work out all these uh, problems. Um. Save super quick. Then we'll hop down this deep dank hole. Awesome. What is this? Analysis. It is a cave-in caused by the collapse of an open space. That's a weird looking enemy. Yes, it is. I always wanted to see what happens if we just skip them. Um... This hallway looks pretty old. Usually anything carved out of rocks is pretty old. To be fair. Seems like they've been here for a long time. What is this place? About to find out. There's nothing like it in the database. Are they dead? To be. Look. Destroyed alien motherships. Welcome <laughs> to the graveyard of our. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just we're here for you to kill me. So let's speed this up, buddy. You to be. Look out, my. <laughs> Aren't you quite the pair? I am. Perhaps we can discuss our current situation. My name is Adam. The aliens you seek are no longer here. They were wiped out centuries ago by us, the machines. Wiped out? And who knows? Perhaps we'll wipe out the androids next. Machines are weapons capable of evolution. We can grow. We can become aware. Eventually, oh, wait, what? the intelligence within our network began to surpass that of our creators. You'd probably be surprised at how quickly it happened. We're not taking damage. Your own creators? Oh. Did I accidentally... What? Motherfucker, are you kidding me? I played this entire game without hitting that button. I did not realize we could do this. Oh my god. This is oh my god. No need to friend. Yep. Oh my god. How? Did they ever tell us about this? I just hit the pad by accident. And it brought us to this. And it's a full health menu with all of the things. This would have been way helpful. For so much of the game. God damn it. They were simple, infantile, almost like plants, I guess you'd say. They held no value to us, but the humans. Yeah, we're just not dying. Now they are interesting. Why? Because they are an enigma. 
they killed uncountable numbers of their own kind. I'm not understanding. Why aren't they? Why isn't it hurting me? It's fascinating, don't you think? What could possibly? Do they accidentally turn on invincibility? That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, that's map. This of and then this is this quick select. How did I never realize this? God damn it! And now, we'll allow you to assist us. You were made in their image, after all. Assist you with what? It's simple. We need you to locate the humans on the moon and bring them Okay, to I'm gonna try... What was it? One of it said, like, had one HP or something. We will then dice... Surely you see the attraction in this. Are you insane? Yeah, it just resets us, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Okay. God damn it! How did I play this game for 80 hours and not realize there was another menu system? That I was completely missing! Son of a bitch. Yeah, I want to return to title screen, please. Oh my god, that would have made everything easier. I've said it, and I said it so many times while playing the game, too. That if the menu system was more like the one from uh, Replicant, where, like, you pause in combat to, like, do the heals and whatnot, that would have made things so much easier for me. Shit! Okay. Damn it. Alright. Okay, 60 hours. I thought we were 80 hours. Anyway. A debug room. Let's go in here and check this out. You haven't been in here before, so. Let's see. Maybe this will be the final thing for tutorial. Okay. Leg tools, which is this. Which, I don't know. Can we fill up every one of these? Or is it limited? None of these seem to be unlocked. I don't know what the hell any of this is. Okay, let's try that again. Small standard enemy. So these are all the different kinds of enemies that we got. Placement. Setting type, standard. Enemy level. Okay, so this looks like this is just like a fighting arena kind of area to test out all this different stuff. Okay.
got all that. Or well, like we did all that. So yeah, this one, like this, this half of this stream, I'm just like trying to learn and figure out how to do some of this stuff. Um, to continue again, we're going to load this up and I'm going to try to go to the same section. And this time we're going to go to commander and see if that does anything. Have to select. I'm just wondering. Wait, hold on. No, it looks like missions exclusive to each chapter. Maybe. Yeah, these two carry over. Okay, I don't know. But let's try to do this. We're playing as nines. I'm going to try to go right up to the bunker and see if we could talk to Commander about the manual, or maybe we have to get the quest and then talk to her. Who knows? We'll see. Yeah, unfortunately, a lot of this seems like just trying to figure out some of this stuff. Lynch will take some time. Boop boop ba doop. Commander, for the first time in centuries, we've intercepted a signal belonging to the aliens. Sure, hold on, do I have the nuclear manual handbook thingy on me right now? Archive. Old world info. Machine repair. Or is it like a physical item? Ah, wow, the wikis are really unhelpful for this game. <laughs> At least one of them is. Alright. I'm trying to figure out the exact location of this book. Because I'm pretty sure we have it, like we handed it over, but I can't find it in our, like, inventory anywhere. Unless I'm completely dropping the ball on this. Archive data. It wouldn't be on its own. It would be under old world info. Probably, like, most likely, that's where it should be. So I don't know why it's not showing up in here. I'm 
Alright, let's see where this sucker is. God damn you, YouTube. Why now must you be a biddy? Okay, it's up. Yeah, it says it's supposed to be in here. What the fuck? These are the creatures that are in direct command of the machine life forms on this planet. If we can destroy them, we can end this long and arduous war once and for all. <laughs> Our intel team is hard at work attempting to analyze the source of the signal, but we're not there yet. We need more data. All Yorha units are hereby ordered to prioritize data collection above all else. We can't let this chance slip through our fingers. Glory to mankind. I used command's data to determine the signal source and marked it on the map. But it seems to be underground. Like, way underground. Guess we'll see once we get there. If we're lucky. You're not much for plans, are you, 2B? Ah, buddy. Back it off, son. I believe it's supposed to be in a lockbox, but... What is this? Analysis. It is a cave caused by the collapse of an open space underground. Why is there such a huge cavern beneath the city? Weird. Even lockboxes stick around after we open them, so I'm not sure why it's not here. Maybe it shows up only after we accept the quest? Ooh, alright, I was trying to get over there. But no, it's supposed to be down one floor in here. And it's supposed to be like right here. sure even those lock boxes are supposed to stick around to be we picked up the signal under the caved in area Let's go check it out. I'm pretty good at playing this game with one hand. Haha! <laughs> Trying to figure out the full list of all archive data. Alright, we're just gonna pick up the quest. Oh, the slides! Was the slide here? At this point in the story? I thought that was not until a little bit later.
Okay, here we go. Alright, I'm looking at a full list of all the stuff in archives. Nuclear Arms Manual. Alright, yeah, it's supposed to be right before all the numbered ones on our list, which we do not have. And yeah, it does seem all the quests for this section reset. Unless, I don't know, maybe there's something with this robot, this suicidal robot, that I'm just not getting. That, like, is supposed to happen later on. I might need to look into it. Or I could try other chapters and see how, like, their side quests play out. If, like, all of them get refreshed. When we go into them via uh, chapter select. Which, that wouldn't be surprising. I'd say a lot of games do that. Don't even at me, bro. Okay, now it's here. There we go. Them and their nuclear vessels. It's data from the old world, but it's... This data is related to the creation of nuclear fission weapons. Oh, jeez. I wonder if we should really hand this over to Pascal. I mean, the commander might want it, right? Only Unit 9S is qualified to make that decision. Shit, what did we do last time? Now that I think about it, maybe we did give it to the commander last time. Shit! Okay, uh, I'm gonna find a safe spot. We're gonna save, so just in case. God damn it. I don't know at what point in the streams that I did this quest, so it's like it's not like I could pull up the video of what I did, like, right away. Shit! Alright. Well, actually, hold on. Let's just get over to the teleporter. We'll save there, and then our thing. Um, I don't think so. You guys are being a little too uh, shooty shooty for me. We're moving on over here. Yeah, after we... Oh no, crap. We might need to save after we hand it in, though. Shoot. I think that's the run button in Genshin Impact as well, so I think that doesn't help. <laughs>
Okay, we didn't get a reward for that, so maybe we did do this one. Let's do it like this last time. Shoot! Actually, there's an easy way. That's, uh... Yeah, I'm pretty sure you don't get rewards again for something you've already turned in in a previous playthrough through chapter select. That would make this game way too broken and way too easy to get get things. We've probably heard that line, like, the most out of any lines in this game, just because they keep triggering it. Every time you walk near this goddamn hole. No, I passed it. I'm an idiot. What, what am I doing? It's, like, right here. This is the place. I'm so dumb. I was thinking it was over more. I'm so dumb. No. It's this, this building. I thought it was the building next to it. Yeah. This time we'll give it to Pascal. It's data from the old world, but it's... This data is related to the creation of nuclear fission weapons. Oh, jeez. I wonder if we should really hand this over to Pascal. I mean, the commander might want it, right? Only Unit 9S is qualified to make that decision. Sorry, Moose. I thought you were a robot. No. Grab the ladder by mistake. All right, how we do, boy? Okay, see, we got rewards for it. Okay, let's save. Let's do chapter select, see if it... Aha! 
We did! Okay, so that's what it was! Baby! That's the thing. That wasn't happening. But then, what about this one? Shared? So maybe shared quests are just ones that both of them can do? At first, I thought shared was like the combined of the two. But it's like, no, it's one's either one. Like the total. So what the fuck did 9S like mess up here? Maybe get killed by him? Wait, does this mean if we hand over the nuclear book, does that mean archives will never actually be complete? Oh, nuclear manual. We kept it. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. So if we give it to Commander, we lose it. But if we give it to Pascal, she'll be like, no. Okay, so we are missing some stuff in the Old World section. Abandoned Factory Memo, apparently, is one that we're missing. Shit, it's found in the same room as the Engine Blade. I don't remember what fucking room that was, man. Oh, I think this is like somewhere in like the way down below area. Okay, engine blade location. And it's in a lockbox. Weird, how did I miss something that was in the same room as that? Oh my god, it's like so deep into this fucking... Ah! The underground section. God damn it. Alright. And it's inside like one of the locked boxes. So shoot. We're gonna have to do this as 9S, but the only way to do it as 9S is like... I think a bit later on. When shit really hits the fan. Okay, so we have to go chapter select and this later half. Actually, yeah, we did have multiple choices when we woke up. I wonder, I thought those would just bring us over to 9S, but it seems like 9S is in a separate chapter on his own. Actually, you know, oh, god damn it, what time is it? You know what, fuck it, we're, we're gonna do it. We're gonna try to get this uh, bit of info. So now that I know that, like, some of these come from quests with multiples, it's like, shit, I'm gonna have to remember what I did last time for the quest, so I know what not to do this time. Just in case some of the quests are, like, more in-depth than that one was. Looks like he's awake. 
I am awake. Yeah, it really feels like Devil and Popolo. We didn't really get much time with them at all in this. I'm in the resistance. That's right. A little thing. Where's you? Uh, her oh. devil without propose. Thanks. Yeah, apparent. Apparent. In me, our mod most, but they use. So yeah, I'd like <laughs> try not. Yeah, I think I got mail quite a bit, but I never really checked it. The jackass fish. Not happening, buddy. I killed us last time. <laughs> oh yeah, teleporter's off because we have to go out here, see the thingy. Be all like, nunny. What is that? An enormous facility that appeared from an area beneath the ground. It would appear to be machine-related in origin. Further details unknown. Mobile transport platform detected in the section emerging from the facility center. So, an elevator? Yeah. All right, teleporter, we are going to the factory entrance. God. Okay, so this isn't... Crap, it looks like it skipped ahead. Fucking, don't do a video where it's like, this is how you get here. And like, skip a fucking whole section area that you're supposed to go through. Because the video goes from taking an elevator to being in this room, and it's like, I know that elevator does not lead to that room. I was like, fuck, man. Alright. Let's try to get through this. It should be all dark down there still. So this should bring us down to, like, the main room. Where all these crazy cult people. But the video has it in, shows that it shows up at this uh, room with the shop in it. Where it's like, nah, man, that's definitely not it. I'm sure lock chests wouldn't be reset. What? It is. Wait, when we redo a chapter, does that mean we have to, like, redo everything we did in the chapter? No, that can't be right. Maybe because that was just, like, a random, like, not... It wasn't a collectible, it was just, like, a medical item. Maybe that's why it reset. We'll see. If not, we might be getting another engine blade. Okay, maybe this was the room that they started in. I don't know. They're all spheres. They all look the spheres. Circles. Whatever. Okay, so what we're looking for is the area where it had, like, a bunch of, of those, uh, not pressure plates, um, 
those machines that would slam down and like kind of are forming robots or making new robots like the giant crushers there's a few different areas like that but uh right now we're just looking for one specifically that we can hop up on top of that's another section I gotta sneeze. <laughs> Something fierce. <sighs> Take this butthole boy down. And we will save here. So we don't have to redo any of this nonsense. Man, I'm so excited. Uh, Cowboy Bebop's coming out. The live action one on Friday. I know I shouldn't be excited, but I am. Like, it's only a matter of time before they figure out how to adapt anime properly into live action. And honestly, I'm not looking for a perfect recreation of the anime. It looks like it's going to be an interesting take, and I hope it is. I don't know where to go from here, so I'm just going down. Alright, let's see here. Check the video. Hopping over that. What we just did. Going up, up. Oh, it's like right there, isn't it? Okay, sweet, sweet. I think we're already like there. But I think it's right here. And we have to hop on top of these. I could have sworn we did this, though. And go across. Oh, no, this isn't the one. Okay, so we go in here. through here this walkway fuck off how many are there oh my god holy shit there were so many of those bastards Okay, we go up on this ledge, and this ledge brings us out to here. This is hard to do at nighttime. There we go. God damn. All right. I remember coming in here now. Getting it and there being a lockbox here. All right. Nero. Abandoned factory memo. God. Why the fuck are there such dicks with these exploding assholes in here? Oh my god. Uncool! I mean, our fucking stats are so buffed up with like a bunch of things. And it's still like a pain in the ass to take those guys out. So it's just like, what the hell are you guys even looking for? All right, we came down here. 
I'm trying to think of where's the closest save point. Shit. I keep forgetting where things are. Okay, it was uh, here. Not after. <laughs> Yeah, I don't trust myself going through the gauntlet, which is this fuck in place. God damn, man. There we are. Safety. Only I could hack it. All right. Anyway, let's teleport the hell out of here. <laughs> Good lord. Just to get a memo. I hate this game so fucking much. Every time I go to that place, I get the thing, I leave, I look at the next thing on the list. Oh, it's back in that same section. Fuck. All right, let's check to see if we even have it, first of all, before we put ourselves through doing that. Oh, so it looks like this is an actual order. Sometimes with the Wikipedia, the order of, like, what it is in the game to just, like, on the list of, uh... Wikipedia is completely different. Okay, the next one. Factory signing. Fucking A. Alright. How did I miss this one? It says that it's in, like, the uh, side section right at the end. Factory signing. I went down to that section before, too, to get another weapon. God, I just missed a lot of shit in that area, apparently. Alright, back into the breach, my friend. Already. Forest. Factory. Okay, well, there's a video on getting it, and it's like a minute long, so this should be super quick. God damn it. Every time I go down there, I think, okay, we now have everything. The, they always add just one more thing. And luckily, it's like a super short. Like, we'll take the other elevator down. The one that puts us, like, right at the boss fight room. And that should get us, like, where we need to be super quick for it. Yeah, this other elevator. Takes a minute to get to.
Oh, that. Okay, holding. Okay, so we're here. Go past it. Nope, other way, come on. It's right here. Oh, thank God, we didn't have to go down. Boom, factor sign sheet. Info master. Pretty sure there's still some more pieces that we need. I don't know why they gave us Info Master. Um, newspaper. And then, yeah, there's something between newspaper and this one. The ticket. So maybe this is just a temporary one that we don't always have on. Oh, okay, so this one is just a ticket that we pick up. Which honestly would be a really quick pickup. It might have been a thing that we've already gotten for something else and already used it. Well, let's go there and see. It's in the area right below the roller coaster where the golden tank is in the amusement park. Oh, ah! Buddy. Stop trying to get all fisty with me. I'm not into rubits that way. So let's see if we can pick up this ticket. Down. I'm just gonna teleport over there, obviously. This will be super quick. Welcome to the tedious parts of trying to 100% a game. <laughs> I'm having so much fun. Okay, let's see here. Uh, Pascal's Village. Park Ruins, there we go. And luckily, the save point for the park ruins is, like, literally, like, a room right next to where we need to be. Yeah, it's a filthy lottery ticket. What we're trying to find. Actually, maybe, no, maybe I didn't use it. I was, I didn't even read it. I just saw it was a ticket, and I was like, oh, amusement park ticket. But no, it's a lottery ticket, so maybe... Ah, uh, it's supposed to be in the grass under the roller coaster area. I wonder if the tank respawned. Which, by the way, I want to figure out what's up with all the gold, the gold enemies. Because they'll, res they'll be spawning at one point until you beat them and then they'll move on. And I don't know how many times they do that. Because we beat this gold tank, I think, two times. Once here and once in the desert. It's supposed to be in the grass. Aha! There you are. He's behind some junk. Just the lottery ticket!
Nice. All right, so that's another one down. Yeah, there's not too many on this list, actually. All right, filthy lottery ticket. Got it. Next one. Got that. Got that. All right, there's one between these two. A strange doll. Okay. That's a little confusing, but I'll try to get it. It's a strange doll. It's found in the forest zone. Yeah, the, the next few streams of this might be tedious. I don't know. We'll find out. I will try to do some of the... Um, we're going to be doing, obviously, more of the uh, other endings for it. But today, I just kind of wanted to do that big one. Since I didn't realize we'd do it like right away. I thought we'd like have that. I thought we'd have like another like little playthrough or something going on. Okay, forest zone. It says from the castle. The front of the forest castle. We go across both bridges until we're in the main forest zone. Then we head left. Up the stairs. Path. Go to the river. Directly forward from the top stairs. Stop. And there should be a lock chest between like two roots. So this is one bridge and then the other one brings us over there. And yeah, no big surprise. We haven't really gained too many levels. We've only gotten one today. Oh, I don't think I've ever picked up this one over here. Eagle Egg. Let's hop down here. That's the one we need to get across. Okay, then we have to go up these stairs on the left. And it looks like all of these are inside lock. Most of these that we don't have are inside lock boxes. Go all the way up the river. God, it's so foggy here. There it is. Oh my god. Lucky. <laughs> We're in a freaking forest tonight. Find it. I just knew it was supposed to be between two thingies. Strange doll. Boom. Another one down. Each one's like 1%, so. Sweet. Strange doll. There's not too many more. I think there's, uh, got it. Got it. Okay, there's only one more. Hmm. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yep. So we just need one more, which is a uh, it's a DVD. Wow, there it's actually wow. There's like a lot <laughs> to do this one. City ruins. Okay, so apparently it's like a weird long jump section. I'm going to look it up just to see exactly uh, what happened with it. Because we did learn that long jump technique before when we had to get that weapon over in the flooded city. It looks like it's near uh, Robo Dojo. Oh shit, that's where it is? Okay, we're gonna have to jump across the freaking highway. God damn. Alright, that is gonna be a long ass jump. Teleport. City ruins. Center. Yes. This is going to put us like right where we need to be. Ah, to get over there, it's going to be a... It's going to be a pain in the butt. Just because the jump... The jump itself is very far. But also to reset to do the jump again takes like a few seconds. So it's like... It's the reset time that's going to make it tedious. Unlike the other one where it's like we fell into water, so we automatically just popped out. <gasps> Luckily, we're like right here. And we have to get to that building <laughs> from here. <laughs> we have to jump this double lane road. Ah, almost had it the first time. Ooh, all right. I'm going to see someone actually make it just to see what their timing was like. Okay, it looks like jump. Wings. Hop up. It, wait, what? Okay, it didn't look like they really dashed. No. There's a way to recover from doing that swing, but I just don't know how. Alright, let's see that one more time. They did the swing move, but they also did more stuff after it. Alright, let me practice that. Because the swing move kind of just dead drops me. Oh, maybe if I could do a dash after it? Okay. No, I, I keep hitting the wrong button to do the dash after it.
Oh, I can double dip! After a dash, I can do it again. Let's see. Okay, it doesn't really kick me up like it does before. Daddy likey, we got her. <laughs> nice, all right, sweet. Boom, and that gives us the DVD. I am a jumping god. We still had we still had another um, grab onto pod and dash in our pocket as well, but we didn't need it just because we extended the jump time doing the slashes. Oh yeah, alright. 85%, which means there's some other category that we don't have everything in. Alright, just a double, just a quadruple check. After DVD, it's just two more thingies, and then all the numbered stuff, which we have. Yep, yep. 1 through 4, and then 1 through 11, and then the thing at the end yep all right so we officially have all of that sweet all right so the plan is obviously like i've said been saying we're gonna get all the endings we're gonna do that uh we could probably pop off a few of the quick ones like right off the bat next time we start and then I'm also going to see about doing all the completion parts on these chapters. So, how we're missing some of these, I'm going to figure out how to do those. Uh, whether or not that actually leads us to some endings or not, who knows. But uh, yeah, that's what the plan going forward is, is uh, completing this stuff in here, as well as getting all the endings. So, uh, yeah. Uh, thank you very much everyone for coming out and hanging out. I really appreciate it. If you could hit that follow button, it really helps me out. Uh, if you want to see any of my past streams, they're all over my YouTube channel. The link is down below for that. I uh, upload all my daily streams over there every day. So just like offset by a day. So today's stream will be uploaded tomorrow or be up tomorrow. And uh, yeah, there's also a link over to my Twitter where I tweet out every day when I'm online and what I am playing uh, today. Right now, the schedule is uh, Nino Kuni tomorrow. And then we are going to be doing some Genshin Impact on Tuesday, which there's a new, I don't know, gardening event, I think, something, botany event happening. I don't think that will really take much time. Uh, we'll get that done. And uh, I don't know, just to kind of mess around. There was a stream, a Genshin Impact stream uh, the other day. We might go over some of that stuff. They did reveal a new character. It doesn't look like we're getting another new island. Uh, which, honestly, I'm surprised that we've already gotten, like, what was it, three new islands since Inazuma came out? So, we're getting one new character. We're, we're getting two new characters, but one of them is, like, brand new we haven't seen in the game at all before. So, uh, we're going to go over some of that on Tuesday. And then uh, next weekend, we will be getting back into some more near Automata, like I said. Trying to get more of the alternate endings and uh, completing some more of those quest things that we didn't get done. But uh, yeah, that is the plan. Uh, thank you very much, everyone, for coming out hanging out. Hopefully I'll catch you guys tomorrow with Nino Kuni. If not, I will see you guys back here next weekend, which will be the next time we will be playing some more near Automata. Bye.